Oh, oh. Greetings, everyone. Oh, oh. Oh. This is Gerard. Energy for Filipino Soul Ma Magazine, aka SGIV Magazine. Stand for Soldiers Got Intention. Believe that. Because everyone should be sold in for something a dream, a goal, an idea, a train of thought, something. Well, I'm in um, Dumaguete now, uh, Philippines. Uh, it was raining, so I wasn't able to play tennis. And I've been, I've been telling myself, I got to post a new video. I got to post a new video. So guess what? I'm posting a new video. <laughs> posting a new video. Things, things, uh, things, things are going good. You know, I'm working on the magazine. I'm not working. I'm not dedicating. <laughs> Thank you very much, Helen. Helen, come here. Say hello. Come here. Helen, come. Ski. Come here. Ski. What's that? Helen, come here. Stupid. Come here. Say hello. Say hello. This is Helen. Say hello. Oh, she's so happy being out, out, of the, uh, out of the house. She loves to ride. Loves to ride. So now she's looking at the one that she's looking at. Oh, should I show you what she's looking at? Yeah. See, this isn't one of the most beautiful places in the Philippines, but this is one of my most favorite places. You know, um, whenever I usually, whenever I go somewhere, I always end up stopping here, either smoking a cigarette or just chilling and just watching, you know, the ships roll in, I guess you might say, as Otis Redding once sung. Um, so as I was saying, I'm not dedicating a lot of time to the magazine as I should, uh, due to my schedule. Uh, um, you know, sometimes when you get into a pace or something, and then something interrupts that pace and it takes you out of your pace, and and then to get back in the pace, and you got a pace to get back in the pace to pace, you know? and that's how it is. You know, uh, so it's moving slowly. And I, I really want to get this thing done because I want to um, uh, I'll go back to the States, you know, and take the magazine to Las Vegas and New York and then say hello and touch bases with a lot of people. I got the front and back cover. I'm not going to tell you who's on the back cover. Uh, of course, you know, uh, Ephraim Bada is on the Filipino side, but I'm not going to tell you who's on the uh, American side till it's actually in the can. So, um, so, but I did do a mark cover. Maybe I will post that. I don't know. You know, uh, man, you know, <laughs> I, I'm just happy, you know, to be here. You know, I develop a cough, a smoker's cough, I guess. And now I got reason to want to, I used to tell everybody I got five more years to live. I got five more years to live. This is why you say that. I got five more years to live. <laughs> you know? <laughs> <laughs> oh well, now I think I found a reason to want to live longer. So then, you know, I'm 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 always conscious of smoking cigarettes, and so I, I quit every day. I mean, I quit every day, and so that, that's where I'm at right now. So this is my latest deterrent to stop smoking. This brother I'm named on um, this uh, uh they used to tell me, uh, Dry, do you know Moses? Do you know Moses? And I said. No, uh, oh, he's, he's a big brother. He's, you got to be Moses, be Moses. So Moses started to become this, this uh, uh, bigger than life figure to me. Because everybody knows him. Everybody says Gerard, you should meet him. You know. And then anyway, so uh, you know, sometimes when you're moving around in traffic, you know, if I see a black cat, I say, Yo, what's up? Or you know, a surefire way to know if someone's American is uh, you say, hey, what's up, Doc? If they say, okay, everything's okay, then you know they are American. Because you know why? Because uh, what's up, Doc, is a term that's used by who? Bugs Bunny. <laughs> if they don't answer that, the chances are they're probably German or, or they're probably um, uh, 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 um, Australian or you know some other Norwegian. But there are a lot of Norwegians around, you know, if they don't know what's up, Doc, don't know how to <laughs> respond to what's up, Doc, that pretty much tells you who they're not. <laughs> so anyway, so, um, uh, so, uh, I always see, you know, whenever I see black 
cats or brothers, I always say, what's up, doc? So anyway, so uh, I used to see this one brother on his bike fast, and we always cross our path, always blow our horn at each other or whatever. So this, you know, we never could catch up to, I even drove around the corner to catch up with the brother, big brother. So uh, I pulled up on him, and uh, uh, he was standing on line at ATM. And so I went behind him and pulled on his pants. And he turned around like this. I said, what's up, my man? And he said, oh, man, oh, wow, oh, wow. Yo, we see each other, oh, wow, 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 wow. So I said, yo, man, so, you know, what's your name? He said, I'm Moses. I said, oh, you are Moses. I hear so much about this brother Moses. Moses, Moses, I gotta be Moses. So finally we meet, we see each other, but I, ne I never knew who your name was Moses. So every Monday, you know, uh, I have card game with uh, with these girls. You know, we play uh, uh, shots of tequila. So I invited Moses to come by, you know, and another brother come by, and uh, and uh, he brought me Moses brought me three cigars. So I said, oh wow, that's cool. I said, okay. So now I got another method, another another uh, uh, distraction from smoking cigarettes. You know, I, I firmly believe that it's a matter of not only am I having something in my mouth, but I think I look good when I smoke. You know, that was telling someone that why you smoke cigarettes. I said, why I smoke cigarettes? I said, because you know what? I think I look good smoking. I don't know why I'm from the old Edward G. Robinson movies or Humphrey Bogart movies or, you know, um, uh, just, you know, yeah, yeah. You're the guy that killed my brother, and I'm the guy. <laughs> There's just something about having, I know I have an oral fix sensation. I, I know that as a fact. Yeah. <laughs> a lot of girls know that too. <laughs> but it, but it, I shouldn't say that because I don't know who's going to be seeing this. <laughs> who might who, who might think they understand or don't know understand what it is that I'm saying? I'm not going to elaborate on it, but yeah, you know, uh, it's all about having something in your mouth. You know? So this seems to work. I only had one cigarette today, you know, which is good. So I'm on my way home. So usually I, I light a cigarette, and so uh, the fact that I'm not doing it now. Uh, lighting one now tells me that I'm off to I'm uh, I'm, I'm um, uh, on the right track. There's uh I have another brother who's coming back from the United States, probably uh, probably in about another month or so. And this one electronic cigarette that I use and I like, I really enjoy. And I ran out cartridges for it. My daughter gave them to me, so. He went back and I gave him money to buy the cartridges and hair relaxer because I need my hair relax. So I can't wait till he gets back with my uh, SOS kit and, so, uh, and my uh, electronic cigarettes. So I plan to use those because I really want to quit. I quit once for 15 years, can you imagine? Yeah, I picked him back up. But anyway, life goes on. Alright, so I just want to stop and pause here and just kind of, I guess you know, um, initiate, you know, my uh, starting to do videos again. I know since uh, Bogart stopped, because we used to do it every month, my giving away 5,000 pesos, and since that ended, I was looking for something to fill the void. I thought maybe I might do something at the club, but do the same thing, but give maybe 1,000 pesos to who, uh, to whoever came in, you know, and have a drawing, you know, one of those type of things. But... <coughs> Uh, but uh, I decided uh, not to do that, you know, for no other reason other than just, it, you know, just didn't pan out. And I thought maybe I might sing soul music or lip sync the soul music to kind of introduce soul music. But then, you know, I, eh, you know, nobody wants to see me. You know, but anyway, uh, remember, dreams are nothing more than plans of waiting action. You see how? Look how. Just steady looking out the window. Oh, oh, I see what she's looking at. She's looking at the birds. You see the birds? <laughs> she's looking at the birds. I wish she had puppies. I love this dog. Uh, my best friend, my companion. Well, anyway. 
uh, dreams are nothing more than plans of winning action. Never disrespect the ugly and always pull you up. And sometimes, sometimes we're on the Oh! Check this out. You know my um, Oakleys are no more Oakleys. I can't get no more um, uh, these dark because uh, it's out of business now, so I, I can't get those. But so I decided on a new look, <laughs> and I want you to tell me what you think. You know, whenever you want to buy a pair of sunglasses, there are three things that you should not <clears throat> cheat yourself on. You should not cheat yourself on the watch you wear. You should not cheat yourself on the glasses you wear, and you should not cheat yourself on um, glasses uh, or bracelet. You should you should always treat yourself good. So one way of finding out if a place has good glasses, ask them if they sell Ray Bans. If they don't sell Ray Bans, then you're in the wrong place. So I found a place that sold Ray Bans. Not that I want Ray Bans, but because I wanted to get a nice pair of glasses. So this is the new look for the kids. So you'll be seeing, you know, me wearing these. You know, um, I just can't get the uh, the dot anymore, and uh, the ones I have are pretty funky. You know, so anyway, all is good. So if you haven't got a dream, or remember, dreams are nothing more than plans of waiting action. Never disrespect the elderly. Or pull someone up. And sometimes, sometimes you're the only one to see your vision. And the best revenge in life is to live good. <laughs> you better believe it. I'm living good today. I hope you are too. And if you're not lucky enough to have a, a dream, a goal, an idea, a trend, but don't worry about it. Do what I used to do. Get as much as you can, as fast as you can, and go. And remember, I always love you more. And if you're lucky enough to have a woman like Ollie Woodson, former lead singer of The Temptation, once sung, treat her like a lady. And ladies, if you're lucky enough to have a good man like Double OG, make him feel like a king. Remember that? Oh, I was gonna tell you that that Monday night card game, drinking tequila. Oh my God, they got me this time. I don't play the game that well, but boy, I drunk so much, man. I, I, I passed out. <laughs> but anyway, it's a good time. We do it every Monday. So if you want to come join me, you know, just let me know. Holla for those of you who are in the in the in the circumference. Come join me Monday, two o'clock to play cards, Filipino card game, shots for tequila. I'll talk to you later. I'll always love you more. And you, 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 you. I love you like a love song, baby. I'll talk to you later. Peace. And don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell.